plus, A plus, A plus, A minus. That must be a mistake. That should be an A plus. Uh, what's that scary red paper thing? For failing to maintain an A-plus average, you are hereby suspended from cheerleading effective immediately. What? Eh, can I do that without a hearing? If I get an A-minus, but I didn't get an A-minus, it's a mistake. So you got an A-minus. What's the big, biggity, big, big, biggity, big, 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 biggity, big, big deal? Who said it was a biggity, big deal? You said that! I didn't say that, and I didn't get an A-minus. Whoa, take it easy. Take it easy. Who's not taking it easy? Oh, not me, that's for sure. I am definitely taking it. Hey there. You know, I've been known to take it easy now and again. You might even say I'm something of an expert. So maybe I'm wrong, but I don't think Melina here is taking it easy. I mean, look at the signs. Bulgy eyes, flary nostrils, scary teeth. I mean, she kind of looks like Pacha does when I use his poncho as a bath towel. <laughs> See? Yeah. Yep, I'd definitely say Melina's upset, but only one way to find out for sure. Let Kronk ask her. Easy! Uh, Melina, are you okay? What? You think I'm not okay? That I'm upset? Well, I'm not. I would be upset if cheerleading was a big part of who I am, but it's not. Even if it was, that A- minus is a mistake. And when it's fixed, we're gonna laugh about it, right? <laughs> okay, good talk. <laughs> So, think she's upset? Hard to say. Ah! My picture! Well, it can't be that bad. Ah! <laughs> the eyes! The eyes! Make them stop looking at me! This is your fault! Hmm, wasn't it you who said, looks aren't important? That's what all pretty people say. I've worked hard to establish a certain standard of perfection, and I'm not gonna let this picture ruin it for me. What do you mean, no retakes? I'm sorry, the yearbooks are already printed. But what does it matter? Your portrait looks just like the most beautiful woman in the kingdom, Isma. Oh, hey, Melina, I just wanted to say thanks. Your yearbook portrait really saved my crop. Ah. All right, that's it. I've got to do something about this. I'm not leaving without that yearbook. The door! Get a thing on Wednesday. We can't hold it. It's too heavy. But if there's one thing I learned reading 263 back issues of Ink and Teen, it's I'm tired of Ink and Teen magazine. Uh, Melina. I mean, who cares about the 10 best ways to not pick off a scab? Don't you think there's more to life than horoscope horror stories? Do I really need to know five things I didn't know about Dirk Rock? Tell me, tell me, tell me! Melina, zippy lippy. If Stinkin' Ink and Teen Magazine wants me, then they're gonna have to get their tardy butt over here and take me just the way I am. Organized sock drawer and all. Well, I'm sorry, my butt was tardy. Excuse me? It's time for Molina's doodles. Which aren't really doodles, more an organizational tool to figure out what I'm supposed to do. Okay, this chart shows how much stress I've been feeling over time. A little at first, a little more, then a little more, a little more. Ow! Okay, start over. I need a pie chart to show how I organize my time because now I'm spending half my time worrying about the interview, a third of my time worrying about what I'm going to wear, a quarter of my time worrying what if I blow it, and another quarter worrying that I'm worrying too much. That's too much pie! Ugh. Okay, what I need is a flow chart to help me start flowing charting. Oh, and a pie chart. And a bar. Oh, I need a pie flow bar chart thing. Ugh. Or I could just ask who's going. Built to beat the high score. Yeah, but you've already got the high score. Not all of them. <laughs> Must win, can't lose. Yes, in your face. 